All right, guys, I got a pretty fun video here we're gonna be cracking. Uh, did one of these boxes already, did all right. Um, I think our autograph was, why am I having a brain cramp as to who it was? So this is the Ben Baller stuff. This is the specialty. Um, you were, if you were a five, 582 member, you were allowed one box. I wanna say it was 250 bucks. But the nice thing about this was there's 24 packs. So you're not really getting gypped out of cards uh, the way that you get in 32 in Topps Chrome Sapphire. So let's toss the box on the floor, jump into the Ben Baller, let's see what we do. Obviously, you know the names you're looking for. Um, I like the design. There's a nice one right off the rip. Gavin Lux. Look at this pack. Nico Horner. Christian Walker. And a nice Walker Bueller. So, I'm a big Walker Bueller fan. So, very nice. Two of the top rookies right off the rip there. Nico Horner and Gavin Lux. Right in the first pack. There's a lot of color in here, which is one of the nice things. So, there's Reese Hoskins. Shinsu. Oh, look at this. Got another stud rookie in there. Nobody thought he was going to be a stud, but really kind of came out of the gates hot and stayed hot. So, And then Zach Gallon, another rookie. So we've gotten three really good rookie cards right off the bat in here. No color yet. I see a Nick Solak on the back, so that's not bad. So there's a Pete Alonzo. Ooh, this looks like it might be the autograph. No, it can't be the autograph. Pete Alonzo. That's a nice one. Put it up there. Trey Turner. There's a Corey Seager green. And our last card in here, like I said, is Nick Solak, which is another nice one. So 69 to 99, Corey Seager. And my guy, Braden Burks, I haven't seen him in my comments a lot lately, but I know that he's a huge Corey Seager fan. So hit me up, Braden, if that's a card you're interested in, buddy. So there's Danny Jansen. There's Locaine. That's a Justin Dunn rookie. Another pretty solid rookie. And Sam Hilliard. So not too, too bad. We're getting a lot of rookies. And they're really not very far into the box. Marcus Semyon on the back. There's Johnny Lester. Is there a an auto in there? I don't know. There's John Lester. Edwin Rios, rookie. Off the back, we've got Semyon. And then a Kansas City Hunter Dozier. Yep. Hunter Dozier green. So Edwin Rios, rookie. So two greens so far to 99. Um, not big names. Hunter Dozier and Corey Seager, who actually had a really nice comeback season, in all honesty, from, from where he was. There's a Cheater Cheater. Really lost, I think most of the baseball community lost a lot of faith in him, and especially how bad he's been this year. Uh, it's kind of proved that he was doing something. There's a really nice Acuna. I know that card's about 100 bucks, or was. I don't think it might be anymore. This kid had a really good year. Anthony Santander, um, and then Manny Machado, who's not every Red Sox favorite. But Santander had a really good year. I didn't realize last year he was 21 homers and 67, but I want to say he, he had over a dozen home runs at least. So pretty solid. I think the 101... Of uh, Robert got pulled out of here and sold for like thirty thousand online. I don't know if that's the bid that was actually that was what it was listed at. There's Eloy, Moncada is a White Sox pack. And there's Yimer Candelario and Miguel Cabrera. It's not stamped very well, but nice Miggy, future Hall of Famer for sure, future first ballot. I'm sure he'll be hanging him up pretty soon. So in this pack we've got a D Gordon jumping out. There's a Mitchie Hanniger. I don't know if Mitch got traded. There's Rysel Iglesias. And the last card in there is Herman Marquez. So a couple good pitchers in the back there. I don't know what Marquez did this year. He really kind of had a coming out party two years ago. But uh, obviously the shortened season this year. I don't think he did a whole lot. But the blue in here. I want to say blue is too. Actually, I don't really know. It's a Bryce Harper. Adrian Moore. I See, I've heard his name said a couple different ways. Adrian Morihan. And Rysel Iglesias again. So blue. To 75, Aricel Iglesias, so not a bunch of great color names. And uh, there's Bruzdar Gratterall, so a couple rookies in that pack. I'd love a low number in here. I've had some success uh, this season with pulling some of the better names. So there's Rowdy Telez. Behind him is Mr. Dansby Swanson. There is Jake Rogers from State Farm and Andres Munoz. Is that a second Munoz? I think we got him on us already, didn't we? Yeah, maybe not. I guess. Uh, oh, we got him in. I just broke some uh, chrome sapphire, and I think that's probably what he came out in. So there's Paulie Goldschmidt. Ooh, here's our die cut, actually, guys. So let's see. We've got a Matty Olson. Our die cut is right there, and it looks like I think I know who it is. There's your quitty. I think it's a Kuna. Ooh, that's beauty. And actually, that's an Akuna to fifty. That's beautiful. 
that's the gold. You can see that's the gold variation. Very nice card. And I think it actually might fit in this sleeve, which is one of the smaller, crappier sleeves that come from Walmart. But gorgeous card. Absolutely gorgeous card. And I like that that's one of our, our parallels. So let me just dump my sleeves into my little container here. So we'll keep moving along. I'll chuck those in there. I get a pile. Haven't hit our auto yet. Got three color, not the biggest names. We've got a bunch of good rookies. There's a Mr. Aaron Judge on the front. Uh, all rise. Tim Anderson is an extremely, extremely underrated player. Very good batting champion from last year. Jose Barrios and a Michael Fulmer. So, I mean, there's there's a lot to rip in here. This is, this is fun stuff to rip. There's a nice one on the back right there. That does pretty decent money. It's probably worth a grade. Uh, so Justin Verlander. Ooh, we did get a red. Look at that. So there he is right there, Fernando Tatis. We'll definitely sleeve him up. Uh, Trey Mancini. Hope he's recovering well from surgery. This is a Blue Jay. Red, is that Cav Biggio? Yeah, that's a nice one right there. Is that, it's not red. The top just looked red. If you looked from the side, it would have looked red. So we didn't get a red. We just got a base Cav and Biggio. So spoke out of turn there. I forgot these aren't uh, blue sapphire, so they're not all going to be blue. They're going to be the color of actual tops chrome, so my bad. Ooh, that's a uh, 85 insert, I think. So there's Pablo Lopez. There's Kyle Seeger. Off the back, we pull Ian Desmond, and this is a Juan Soto. Very nice. It's a nice card there, Juan Soto. <coughs> Excuse me. Actually, you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to sleeve up that Tatis base. Probably should sleeve up quite a few of these, but I'll do that at the end, save you guys the boredom. <clears throat> okay, so we've got Horner, we've got Lux, we've got Kyle Lewis, Solak. Ah, there he goes. A nice one on the back right there, guys. Take that off right now. Throw that in the sleeve. Mr. Trout. I guess he's all right. He's a decent player. There's an Austin Matthews. There's Luis Castillo. And there's a Randy... Air, God, I can't say his name. Arizarania? Arizarania? He's, I think he's gaining a little bit more traction in this postseason, but I'm not totally sure. Brandon Lau, extremely good player. Uh, there's a Jesus Lazardo base. It's a good rookie. Robel Garcia base, another good rookie or decent rookie. I don't know if he cracked a big club this year. Juan Segura or Gene Segura and Brandon Lau. So, is Mr. Ustremski, who had a great season this year too. Uh, Trevor Williams, JD for my Red Sox collection. I'll put him up there. Reese, 85. Not anything spectacular. We'll put him in the, the color pile. And Mike Yastrzemski, who in my opinion is a is a budding superstar. I really wish he had cracked the big. He's a little bit of a younger age, but um, I mean, he's, he's still really holding his own. So nothing wrong with that. There's a nice one there. Brendan McKay, another kid who hasn't really done a whole lot. Ooh, and right behind him, Jordan Alvarez. So there's another pair of rookies that are... Uh, Extremely, extremely talented. Robbie Ray and David Peralta. So we've taken pretty much out of here, everybody out of here, except Bichette and Robert. So there is a green in here. Yep, there is a green. So there's Colin Moran and Drelton Simmons. There is a Javi Baez green. That's not bad. That's the 99. And a Liam Hendricks. Javi Baez is a solid name. 84 and 99. It's funny. I haven't pulled much quality color out of here, but... So be it. There's Logan Webb rookie on the back. Oh, we got another die cut. Carter Keyboom. I know you're guaranteed one. I didn't think you were guaranteed two. Logan Webb rookie. Carter Keyboom. So I'm wondering if this is autoed. Wow. Woohoo! Look at that thing, huh? Mike Trout. So maybe that other one played as a. Uh... So we got a Trout die cut. And an Acuna die cut to 50. So I'd say that was a. It's been a pretty worthwhile box. Haven't seen our autograph yet. There's a second Andrew Elton Simmons. There's another Liam Hendricks because they're in order. There's Miles Mikolas. And Jack Flaherty is an extremely good pitcher. Really live young arm. I want to say that that's... Ooh, there's a gold, and I'm wondering if that's an auto. Yeah, my guess would it be it will be. I'm not gonna slow roll it. So there's Mauricio Dubon. It's a pretty decent name. It's not a rookie, but or it's excuse me, it's not an auto, but Sean Murphy Gold. Not bad. And then there's Mike Soroka. So Sean Murphy Gold, 27 of 50. I like Sean Murphy. I think he's gonna be a really solid player going forward, but 
Uh, jury's out, so haven't seen our autograph yet. Down to last two packs. I don't know if it's in here or not. I can't really tell, but I'm going to have to kind of roll with it. So Domingo Leyva is a Matt Tice rookie. Sixto Sanchez and Thor. So we're going to go down to the last pack without getting our auto yet. So let's hope they didn't forget it. I'm sure they didn't. Oh, look who's on the back. There you go. It's going to be an orange auto. Wow, this is quite the box, let me tell you. So there's Clayton Kershaw. Let's slow roll it. It is a Dodger. Is it Gavin Lux? No, it's Edwin Rios. We didn't get an autograph, guys. Wow. Maybe you weren't guaranteed an autograph? Edwin Rios, orange to 25. And there's a Boba Shet. So this is quite a box. I mean, don't get me wrong. This is absolutely an incredible box. But I'm kind of shocked there was no... I think you were guaranteed an autograph in here. Did I miss it? Did I just look past it? I don't think so. Alvarez, Solak, Kai Lewis, Horner. I mean, those are big names. I don't think I looked past it. Maybe I did. Nope. Ah, man, did I? I don't think I missed it. I would have been... Does it say you're guaranteed one auto on the box? Hmm. I'll have to look really quick. Slide that right here, slide backwards. Ben Baller, officially... Oh, no, you know what? You're not guaranteed an auto in this. The autos are actually really, really rare. I'm sorry, I just... I had a sapphire brain fart. The autographs in here are... Uh, let's see. So red is one... Uh, orange is one in 41. Uh, the autographs are, though... Uh, gold. You, so you can only get them gold, orange, red, and a super... So you can only get them in those three colors. So that's when I saw the orange. I thought, oh, well, maybe we got lucky. But I'm pretty sure that the uh, Penn's diamond inserts are 1 in 24. So that's pretty good. We got two. We got two of the diamonds. Uh, Acuna and Trout. We got a Soto. And then, I mean, our rookie stockpile is great. We got a Bichette, Brendan McKay, Jordan Alvarez, Nick Solak, Kyle Lewis, Nico Horner, and Gavin Lux. So I mean, you almost hit everybody you'd want except Robert. So... Very cool, guys. Thanks for tuning into another box of this. This is easily the best box I open to this stuff, hands down. And uh, we'll catch you all in the next rip. All right, take care.